I need advice on how to fix PS4 internet problems. First, make sure it is actually connected to the internet. I do not have to make sure it is connected. The PS4 controller, and even the console connection to the internet, is usually wireless now. If the Wi-Fi connection is being dominated by someone else watching Netflix or downloading, you'll have internet problems with a PS4. My PS4 has typically worked, even if other people were working online. If too many people are trying to use the same Wi-Fi connection, it could slow down the PS4's connection to Sony, to the point that the PlayStation's connection times out. All I know is that is the opposite of my idea of a good time. How could I fix it? Try an old-school wired connection to the Internet, instead of using Wi-Fi for both the controller and console, plus anything else in the room. Or making sure that Wi-Fi connections for smart house monitoring networks are not all in the same cabinet, interfering with the PS4. True, interference from other Wi-Fi from wireless phones to security cameras can interfere with it. Then you're down to moving them apart, and checking line of sight to solve it. Pity tinfoil hats won't solve it. If putting the router on a LAN cable did not fix it, you may want to determine if using a different cable would fix it. I've heard changing NAT settings could fix it. You want NAT too, because open NAT is an open invitation to a hacked system. Whereas NAT3 has so many security precautions, it slows down your internet connection more than an NSA checkpoint does to your travel plans. I hate choke points and slowdowns in general. Speaking of slowdowns, check to see if the PS4 is trying to update while you're playing. It'll slow down gameplay. If I run updates in rest mode, it can lock up. Not if you set it to run updates and but not go in rest mode, or move the controller once in a while, so the updates go while it is not in rest mode. I need to Google that solution. Depending on your system, you might want to check the DNS settings on the PS4, compared to what Sony says it should be. Google that instead, assuming you do not want to use the Google DNS settings. As long as connectivity problems are solved, I try it. Google the Sony server status if you keep having connectivity problems. The PlayStation 4 tries to connect to Sony when you turn it on, and if their servers are down, you'll get connectivity problems. But my system wants to update the firmware. So try downloading the firmware updates that might solve the problem somewhere other than Sony. Their support site has alternate links to getting it.